for technical reasons, the uh, Wild Show has not been recorded this week. So I'm just going to repeat the main, main points I wanted to get over here in uh, Heavenry Park. Uh, it's mostly about Creative Commons because there's a, a conference in Lisbon this, this week that we're trying to relate to. And there's a couple of things about YouTube that could be, could be a bit better, I think. Uh, there is a Creative Commons option, but it's not very well known. And it's a bit hidden how you, how you select it. It's on the advanced tab when you add information about, about a clip. But a lot of people don't seem to use it, even though I think they, they, they might if they knew about it. And then also, when, when you come to edit it, it's now quite hard to find the option of, of seeking out all the Creative Commons stuff so that you can remix it, re-edit it uh, with something else that you've done or else just do a new bit with, with existing Creative Commons video. The, the other topic which I think is related is playlists because the playlists might be Creative Commons content or it might be copyright stuff but if you, if you create a, a playlist you're, you're able to put all kinds of content in a sequence and you can do linking bits and put them in as well if you, if you choose to but I, th I think the playlists are, are getting more hidden away also uh, they used to select them or display them on the right hand side if there was a, a track playing you know, and playlists exist those, those would get publicised but now they've got their own mix which is, is created by a robot and I, I think the handcrafted playlist is probably better than a robot in, in most cases. That's my claim anyway. It should be there as, as an option. So we'll probably come back to these points uh, on the Wild Show and on the We Not Know Show when, Wednesday or Thursday and maybe other shows also on, on Phonet FM and other places.